beautiful people Zion coming at you again with another tutorial there's an old saying that once you start something you know you have to be able to finish it in this case from one Dennis Brown to the other so you know I've been doing a lot of Bob Marley you know tutorials so it's fair now if you guys are not really familiar with Dennis Brown he's a prince of reggae a man that released over 60 albums you know again the prince of reggae now, I'm going to leave a link to this song, the original song, in the description. So you guys go ahead and check it out. Very beautiful song. And if you have not yet subscribed to my channel, hey, this is a place to be if you want to hear a lot of Caribbean music, you know, reggae, ska, soca, and so on. You know, hit that red button down there. That's the subscribe button. That's what it is. Hit that. Hit the notification bell. Hit all whenever it pops up. So whenever I post a new video or a tutorial, You'll be the first to know. But hey, let me show you how to play this one. Grab your guitars. Let's go. Normally when a song has like two or three cars, I would say it's a very simple song. But in this case, it's not so simple if you're not familiar with extended cards. All right, so you guys need to pay attention to this one. All right, this one is funny because he uses two diminished cards, okay? But you got to be, you got to listen to the song to get the perfect, to get the right voice in, okay? So, <clears throat> I'm going to try to make this tutorial as short as possible, all right? So, what you want to play this song is a, a D minor first. Now my guitar is clean. I only use my wah pedal at time, you know, at time to time. From time to time. <laughs> at time to time, damn. Anyways, yeah. So, a D minor. Right, some people will play D minor, A minor to G minor, but in this case it's going to be a D minor to A to a A diminished to a G min diminished. Okay, the funny thing about diminished, especially in this position, it can be played all over the guitar. All right. So it can be promised land, going to the promise. You know, you know it's, it's funny, but I'm going to teach you guys one. All right, I'm, as like I said, I'm going to make this tutorial as short as possible. We can talk about, you know, the theory after, like in a different tutorial and all, which I plan to do. So let's get this D minor. By the whole fifth fret, place that middle finger on the second string of the sixth fret. Pinky finger on the third string, seventh fret. Ring finger on the fourth string, seventh fret. Or you can lift the pinky finger to get that D minor seventh. All right, so this is the way I plead. So when you go, promise that. Then I want to go to. You're gonna see right behind it. Alright? So it's a 
promised land. Then I want to come for this diminish. To farm this, let's not talk about the name. So let me show you how to farm this card, all right? You want to place the middle finger on the second string, seven fret. Point a finger on the fourth string, seven fret. Pinky finger on the first string, eight fret. Ring finger on the third string, eight fret. So you go promise. And to get that next card, you just want to go a semitone, half, like right there, right behind it. So you're going to go. Okay, so that's basically it for the song. B minor to the diminish. So you go, the promised land, going to the promised land. Oh, sorry. Promised land. If you choose that one, you want to bring the same position down there to the third fret you start there. And then right behind it. Some people are going to play from that the first position like I showed you, but this time you're not going to go on half, you're going to go a whole. So it's like a A diminish to a G diminish. So most people are going to say this is the one. Going to the promised land. But like I said, you got to be, you got to listen out for it. All right, let me play the track. So you guys can hear what it sounds like. So listen. See, my way works, yeah? But well, listen to this. Listen to this one. My one looks now. Second one. That sounds a bit warm, I like that. Here's the next one. So they all work, right? Yeah, and everybody's favorite part, the stock line. Stock line goes like this. All right, so let me play it slow for you guys. Gotta be real quick when jumping back up to the A right there, all right? So a little bit of practice and you get it. Yeah, man, and that's it. That's all there is to this song. I would like to say it's a simple song, you know, with three simple chords, but if you're not familiar with extended chords, then it might be a little bit challenging. But of course, very short tutorial. It's stock line is good also. Now guys, if this tutorial was helpful, if you like it, put it down there in the comment section. Drop all your comments down there. Remember to like, comment, share. Most importantly, remember to subscribe. My name is Zion. I'll see you next time with another tutorial. Blessed love. Peace out.